Welcome to Engineering Studios. Arches have been a prominent feature in structures, including vaults, arcades, and bridges especially. From our another video introducing the types of bridges, arch bridge is one of four fundamental types of bridges. An arch is a curved structural form. It supports a vertical load primarily by axial compression, transferring them around the profile of the arch to foundations on either side. The masonry arches have been well developed and applied in the structures by the Romans, even the Etruscans, who are credited with its invention. The arches are self-supporting, stabilized by the force of gravity, acting on their weight to hold them in compression. This makes them very stable and efficient, capable of larger spans and supporting greater loads than horizontal beams. As shown on the Roman arch, the first voussoir, or springer, rests on the impost, at the top of the abutment or pier. The haunch, rising from the impost to the crown, the highest point, is defined by the inner curve, or intrados, and outer curve, or extrados. The Roman arch, with its semicircular intrados, has a rise exactly half the width of the span. The inspiration of engineers never runs out. After Roman arch, other types of arches have been developed. The stilted arch has vertical sides. A Moorish arch widens above the spring points. The trefoil arch's intrados has three indentations, or foils. A Gothic arch is a pointed arch usually having two haunches of equal radii of curvature. A Tudor arch has greater curvature near the springers than near the point. A OG arch form was developed during the English Gothic period and follows a concave arc that flows into a convex arc with pointed crown. Each haunch of the OG arch consists of a double curve. Except for those wonderful aesthetic performances on buildings, the arch is always a popular structural form on bridges, since the early stage, when only stones were available as the building materials. Masonry arch bridges have an extraordinary durability. The Arcadico Bridge, dating from the 13th century BC in the Peloponnese, Greece, is one of the oldest arch bridges still in existence and use. Nowadays, with the development of lightweight and high-strength materials and engineering knowledge accumulation, the modern arch bridges have enabled us to travel across the pre-nominal barriers. The arch span has increased from meters to hundreds of meters. The longest steel arch has been built in China, called Pingnan Third Bridge. It has a main span length of 575 meters. The longest concrete arch is also built in China, called Qinglong Railway Bridge. It has a main span length of 445 meters. With the introduction of this video, you probably can tell what kind of arch was used by the Arc de Triomphe in Paris? Thanks for watching. Subscribe to keep updated. See you next time.